hello viewers i welcome you to omama page and please if today be the first time you are visiting the channel you kindly subscribe you like then you share on your screen right now is how printing papers are being cut in the printing house before we can print on any paper in a printing house, like you are going to print poster, invitation, and other sort of printing works, the papers has to be cut according to the size of the work. So this is the main machine they use to do the cutting in a printing house. So let's dive into the video and see the process they go through in cutting papers in the printing house. Thank you. Thank you, my sister. And how are you? I am also fine. I am called Mike. And I work at Trust Joint Printing Press. Okay. I'm into printing and in printing before you can print a work you need to cut a papers according to the required size or according to the work so this is the main machine that they use to cut the papers so I'm in charge of printing this machine and we have almost uh, five types of the machine that we feed with papers so they bring the papers and i will cut according to their required size before they can print yes this is printed work we are finished printing and i'm just doing a final cutting or finishing cutting so i'll cut it according to the printer size then we'll send it to a machine to number so after the numbering we'll send it to the collator then the collator will arrange it according to the numbers i want to show you a finished book i think i was having one here Yes, yeah, so after finish everything, after we have finished everything, this is how it will look like. Okay, and this one it has a triplicate. So if you write on the first page, it will appear on the second page, and it will also appear on the third page. So this is exactly what I'm cutting now. Yes, this machine does the cutting. Using this machine is very very risky, so you the operator must always be extremely cautious because the cutting machine uses blade and it can cut your hand away. So you the operator must be very careful using this machine. And this method that I'm touching is called clamp. This clamp will press the paper, will hold the paper firm before the blade will cut it. And you know, we used our two hands to work. So it's sometimes a bit safe. Unless you play careless, that will get hurt. And even the clamp alone, can hurt you because it's very heavy and it comes with pressure okay. yeah this machine can spoil people's work if you are not careful with it like i said you the operator has to be very very careful always so you have to insert the papers uh, carefully as you will spoil 
people's work. And these days, paper is very, very expensive. So imagine if you spoil uh, someone's work, you might be forced to pay the paper. Yes, we use measurement in this work. And mostly, when this machine is uh, imported from abroad, we disconnect some of the functionalities for easy operating in Africa. Example, this controllers here, this bottom, previously, when you press it, it will cut the paper automatically. And there's a sensor also here, this one I'm touching. It also prevent it also prevent uh, unexpected cutting. Yes. Yeah, so in case in case you set your hand there, when this controller was in, the machine will automatically go off in order to prevent cutting or unexpected cut. But when it came, you have to disconnect it for easy use because if if you leave all these controllers in. Uh, operating this machine is sometimes a bit difficult so when it comes then we disconnect it so using it is, is a risky and everything about printing when you bring we will do it nicely for you Oh yes, in some ways, school is very very important in printing work. Because like I said, we use measurement here. So if you are not educated, how will you be able to measure? So you have to calculate before you measure. And every paper has a size. So in some ways, or in some part of printing, education is very very important but if you get a good operator to it can show you how to calculate and measure the paper before you cut by all the same education is also very very important So what I would say is school is important in this printing way. Yes, I accept uh, anyone who wants to learn this way, provided the person is serious. So in this world, if you want to learn anything and you are eager, you be able to achieve what you want. So you can locate trust joint at Asafo behind the palace. Close to the palace. So if you get to the palace, that's behind the palace, and you ask for trash joint, you'll be directed to our office. So we do all sorts of work concerning printing, as wedding, wedding invitation, calendars, all souvenirs. So this is my director's uh, or my boss contact on the screen. You can call and make inquiries about any printing work, and we'll be happy to receive you. So, this paper side that you see here is 30 by 40 inches. 
Uh, like I said, you have to calculate it and cut it according to, according to the customer's required size. So like I said, you have to calculate and measure before you cut. Because you cannot insert this big paper into the machine. So for now, I'm coming to cut A3 big. And A3, if you add two A4 sheets, you get one A3 sheet. And if you add two A3 sheets, you get A2 size. So this A3 big, I'm coming to cut it 17 by 13 inches. The reason why we are cutting it A3 big or A3 extra is that after printing, those extra parts will be cut away, then we get exactly A3 size. That is why we cut it A3 extra. So this size is A3 extra, but I have to measure it again and see if it's a correct size. I have to trim this part away. So viewers, this is how they cut printing papers in a printing press before it's being inserted into a printing machine for machine to print. I hope you enjoyed the video and please don't forget to subscribe, you like, then you share. And if you have any comment too, kindly drop it under the comment section. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.